Hi you guys, welcome back to our channel. This is Rich and Sarah learning as we grow and I am Sarah and Rich is not here. All right, you guys, if you're still watching, <laughs> I wanted to honestly give you guys a big thank you and show you some love and tell you how much I love you guys. And I am so thankful for each and every single one of you. You all have been amazing. I shared a video yesterday and I'll put it up here in the um, bubble. I don't know. <laughs> I'll put it up here and I basically shared about my struggle with my weight loss since having my twins and it's super late at night right now and I thought I was in the shower obviously um, which is why I look so lovely <laughs> and I had just gotten the kids to bed and everything and I was like okay how do I move on from that video because that video was pretty intense I shared with you guys just truly my heart I mean I picked up the camera and I just shared with you what I was feeling that day as far as just everything life-wise with my weight and with my health and everything and I had made a decision that day that I am gonna change um, my diet around I basically made a decision that day that I am going to change my lifestyle as far as what I'm eating my exercise my water intake all that kind of stuff my sleep habits and you guys were amazing I mean I literally had hundreds of between everything of comments on our actual channel um, Facebook private messages Facebook messages uh, text messages emails everything of just all of you offering your love and your support to me to try and just like get this weight off and so I've been jokingly calling it like project mama get the weight off on Instagram, but um, it's true. So I'm gonna be I feel like you guys care and so I want to share with you guys this process and it really does help hold me accountable while I'm trying to do it so I'm gonna document it I think every Friday is what I kind of told Rich I said I think I'm gonna share this well first I showed Rich wasn't home you guys Rich was with the Marines all week and he came back and I was like I filmed something I had a little bit of a breakdown moment <laughs> after our anniversary and I showed it to him like after I had already put it up and he was a little bit like okay that was like that was very raw and very very real and very you and I said I know and he's like well I mean you really put yourself out there to be vulnerable with everything and I'm like you know what I don't care because you have to put yourself out there I mean there's so many things on YouTube that we see where people are just you know trying to put whatever's the most sensational out there or like whatever the clickbait is and I don't want it to be that I mean there's some of that that's fun you do sometimes for fun like little announcements or stuff like that but I really want I want us to have a relationship so I want our viewers and our friends who subscribe and family I want you guys to really know who we are and what's going on in our life the ups and the downs and everything so I let you in and I know when you do let someone in just like in any relationship you risk getting hurt but you also risk not even risk but you also open up the doors to have an amazing friendship or an amazing relationship so that is why I let you guys in on that and just like I had hoped there was response was amazing you all shared so many stories I'm trying to write back to all of you guys right now so if I haven't yet forgive me but I will get to it in the next day um, because it's it just the encouragement like the overwhelming encouragement mothers wrote in and told me that they had had twins and that they lost some of them over 100 pounds 60 pounds 40 pounds I mean it was amazing even if you lost two pounds it's like good for you girl you know like it was good and so I think as women a lot of people were saying that you know we don't need to be so focused on our body types and I could completely agree but I also think as women it's awesome that we are supporting each other in our struggles to try and help make our challenges um, a little bit easier and so I thank you guys for that so day one of project get mama thin is in the books you guys the whole day today I did amazingly well I'm like super happy pat on the back pat on the back like I feel so great about myself I shared on Instagram that I had um, Starbucks today with friends and I did not order anything you guys I ordered myself a water and I ordered myself a I'm trying to think an oatmeal I couldn't remember the name an oatmeal with like nothing on it like I did throw some like nuts on it but that was it I didn't do the bad stuff and I feel pretty great so yeah so Friday I will give you guys the full update I don't want my whole channel to turn into like everything diet so you're gonna get back to our regularly scheduled vlogs tomorrow 
but because Rich has been away, um, I didn't just hit him up when he got home with like, hey, let's start filming a vlog tonight. So that's why you've had just a lot of me the last couple days. But I am going to share with you something I did today, which I'm hoping to keep it up. And let me know if you guys have any other suggestions, because you guys have awesome suggestions. But I had my oatmeal for breakfast with fruit. And then, I'm going to try and hold this up for you guys. I had a protein shake for lunch. Um, I just put up like a few strawberries on my... Um, my what's it called Ugh, oatmeal my brain is fried you guys it's late but for lunch I a lot of people suggested like do a do a healthy protein shake and I didn't want to do something that was like a weight loss shake so I got this from sprouts um, and I've had it but it's a vegan protein it's vanilla flavored it's pretty good I think it's over 20 grams yeah 20 grams of protein so I did like a scoop of this with a little bit of like unsweetened vanilla almond milk um, and then I put in a few, like a little bit of fruit and some spinach, some greens in there. And I put like the turmeric powder and stuff. And it was like an amazing, it kept me full, you guys, for so long. Like it kept me full up until dinner. And dinner I just had salad with chicken on top and then like a balsamic vinaigrette that I made. So that was my day. And then, so okay, so this is what I'm sticking to right now so far. The protein shake in the afternoon. Like oatmeal, fruit, kind of maybe an egg in the morning. Um, everybody has been saying to get hemp seed and I put it on my salad tonight because it has like that little crunch that I crave instead of croutons and that was pretty good. I loved it. It was amazing. I, I've been super like upping my water intake. I've also had my LaCroix and the only other thing that I am doing differently too so far, I mean this is day one you guys, but I have decided I'm not eating anything past like 7 o'clock at night. So from 7 o'clock at night till 7 a.m., 8 a.m. in the morning, like no food, like nothing, just water. And um, and we'll see how that goes because a lot of people have said they've had success with that so that is it I don't feel like I'm somebody to give tips yet but that's just what I've done for the first day and my energy level feels great I'm pretty happy I'm not like I mean I will say I felt a little deprived tonight <laughs> What did Rich have? Rich had something and I was like, oh, he had candy from his birthday. He had like Swedish fish and I was like glaring at him from across the room. I got over the whole Swedish fish thing by having a cup of tea and that seemed to help because it filled my tummy and it was like warm and I don't know. We'll see. But all in all, day one seemed pretty great. I'm not going to give you guys an update every single day because I feel like that would get obnoxious. Um, but I will every Friday give you an update on how much weight I've lost. I documented my weight. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to show it, you guys. I'm probably going to show it. I'm not <laughs> I documented my weight uh, this morning for you and I'll do it every day. I know they say don't weigh yourself every day. I have to. I'm one of those people. I'm type A in that way. And um, I know they also say don't call it a diet. It's a lifestyle. And I agree, but I have to call it a diet because if I do not call it a diet, I will totally find a way to cheat. And you guys will be seeing me at them taco trucks and you'll be like, all right, so this way, if you guys see me at a taco truck, you can be like, girl, you are not, like, you need to step away from the taco truck, and that's going to be my biggest downfall. I have also heard that you should allow yourself, like, one cheat day a week, and so I'm toying with that, but I don't think I can even begin to do that until I've lost 10 pounds, and then maybe I can kind of add that in there. Anyway, enough about my diet and my food and my eating and all that stuff. I kind of just wanted to film this video because I was like, how do I go from like super emotional crying to you guys about my fat butt to like just back to our regular vlogs? And I thought the best way to do that was to kind of have this like nice little gateway into back to our channel and to thank you guys so much for everything. So tomorrow you will see a regular scheduled vlog You'll see Aunt Glenda coming back this week. You'll see Rich and myself and our shenanigans and our cute little kiddos and our adorable cat. And we thank you for being part of our family. I thank you guys so, so much. You will never know. Like, I went to bed reading those comments last night and my heart was like so full. And I love you guys for that. And thank you. Please, please, please share in the comments below. Like, every week when I post, please share what is working for you diet wise. Like, if you have some cool tip or something, like, let me know. Like, what do you guys like? Like, snacks are the biggest thing because I am such a snacker, which is how I got this way in the first place. So, what do you do for snacks? And if you just say carrot sticks, I might have to kill you. So, give me something real, okay? Don't be hiding on me, okay? Be real about it. All right, you guys, thank you so much. And we love you from our heart to yours, from our family to yours. Keep on growing. Peace. See you manana. Bye, guys.